day of racing in Sydney Harbour, some really nice conditions. Uh, yeah, pretty windy, something we didn't have for quite some time. Uh, the last events have been quite light to medium winds, so quite new again for us and a lot of learnings. Yeah, we made a lot of progress throughout the week. We attacked today really well with two good starts in the first two races, but uh, couldn't really hold our position. We had a couple of big crashes at the leeward gate, but also in some jibes, and that cost us a lot of points. And in the last race, we got stuck in a lull at the start, which meant uh, we were playing catch up. The wind was very, very strong at times and very unstable, so certainly made for some very tricky maneuvers. And can't say that we were very happy with the day. Uh, we really didn't execute, unfortunately, around the racetrack. Left a lot of points out there, and so we really have to make sure we look at what the mistakes were and make sure that we come out firing. A bit disappointing in terms of results. We could have done better, lots of learning, and uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll bring that into the next event. I think the challenge in, in SailGP, especially for a new team like us, is we don't get extra training time to catch up on the more experienced team. So we try to bring that experience from outside and that's why we brought people like Glenn or Nathan and Will to try and fast track this learning and, and make every day as productive as possible. Nice to be back on Sydney Harbour and, and really cool to be working with the team this week together. Great atmosphere, a lot of really great tailors and yeah, pretty intense days out there for the race day. Uh, Action packed day, really, really cool to see all the boats so close and the racing's the highest level there is out there at the moment. So great to be part of it here for this event. I know it seems like there's a big gap in the point sometimes between first and second and all the rest in the pack, but the margins are so small in this fleet and uh, just great to be here with the challenge ahead of us. For the Swiss team coming away from this event, a couple of maneuvers and performance things that we can kind of focus on. So I think everyone's really hungry already to get back into racing and those four weeks can't come soon enough. And I'm really looking forward to the next one.